Hey guys, welcome to David vs. Film. I am David, your soy W. To my right is Mark. This is Mark. And tonight we're going head to head with the Santa Claus 1994. A big hey, hi, and hello to all of you, but to returning viewers and especially returning subscribers, what's up? Now, you've never seen the Santa Claus, right? You mean the real Santa Claus? No, no the one movie. has. The movie to Santa no, Claus. No, I've never yeah, seen the Santa Claus. Okay, I didn't, I figured you hadn't because this is not Mark's kind of movie. He mm -hmm. actually no movies are really your kind of movies, right? Like you have some you like, but these family holiday favorites, mm, they're kind not of like, my favorites. Yeah, you're kind of mixed <laughs> bag on, right? Because you enjoy Home Alone. Yes, which is coming up by the way. We're gonna do part two. We decided we already done part one, so check out that video if you haven't seen it. But you like Home Alone? I did like Home Alone. Um, it was a lot of fun. So I think you'll like this. You just have to kind of you have to kind of watch it and see. Yeah. So I think I remember seeing the trailer when I was young. Yeah. I think what year? With ninety four. Ninety four. It was probably like 12, 13, yeah. something like that. 30, and I remember... 31. Okay. Whatever. I remember seeing it was Tim Mallon turns into like the Santa Claus and... Well, you'll have much, to see. Spoiler alert. Much, well, that's pretty much... Well, it was on the trailer and of course you see him I mean, on yeah, the I movie I think we think it's going to be about so. the Easter Bunny, right? So yeah. no, no bait and switch there. But you guys <laughs> seem to like it. In fact, this one actually won the poll yeah, over on Patreon that. that we put out there about which holiday movie uh, you guys want us to see. Yes. So that one over there. So Must be good then. Hopefully you guys like it. Now, to make this a little more fun, what are you drinking, sir? I'm drinking spiked lemonade from the taco stand on the street. They have spiked lemonade the tacos? Oh, no, it's regular lemonade, but I kind of spiked it. There we go. That's a, yeah, and it's even further down the street from Chick-fil-A where they have the Lord's lemonade. That's certainly a different version of, of that. I have my peach tea, which also is uh, spiked, as you know from previous videos. From the taco stand on the street. Yeah, from the taco <laughs> Exactly. Um, and then also, real quick, before we get started, we just want to say that if you'd like to see the full-length version of this reaction, along with some other exclusive perks, please visit our Patreon at patreon.com slash film. We have so much fun over there. It's a great community. No pressure, but if you want to check it out, we would absolutely love that make our holiday come true <laughs> second of all if you are liking your videos here on youtube we certainly appreciate you watching here as well just please consider giving us subscribe that is completely free to you and it really helps out the channel a like does as well and last but not least if we're not friends on instagram let's be friends i'll leave a link to our instagram down below yeah. <laughs> we're so glad you guys are joining us we hope you have a lot of fun with this video and now if you guys are ready I think we're going to go on this one, right? Awesome, yes. Okay, then let's turn our hymnals to page 1994 as we enjoy the Santa Claus. Is he coming to town? Oh, he's coming to town, all right. Mm. Oh, that's, the, that's that work carpet right there. Oh, gosh, you're right. Ho, ho, ho. Who are you calling a ho? Santa Claus. Oh, with an E. They added the E oh, like it's a clause. Oh, the clause. Like contractual Santa. Outlaw production, so oh, it's yeah. a law firm. It's going within the renegades. Oh, it's Frank Barone. Oh. Special thanks to the people responsible for our record-breaking sales, Scott Calvin yeah. and Susan Perry. All right. Good our job, Barone. Scott. Whatever her name was. Tell it to the tip jar, honey. Oh, there it is. Tim Allen. This is this is in the high heavy home improvement days. He's the top of his game back Goodness. then. So young. Our families aren't here with us right now. Probably why Johnson's secretary sitting in his lap. <gasps> <laughs> Drive safe. Thanks very much. You can't say that today. It's a different time, different time. Yeah, this would have been almost 30 years ago. Ooh. And you can't drive that car. In my either. new Ford Taurus. That's a company car right there, baby. The Pineapple Express. Polar Express. Oh, you the, know, the Polar family Express. Version. Yeah. Pineapple Express, them getting high and wondering where they are half the oh. time. Okay. So little Dorothy. Dorothy. I know where you're going with this. You're going to call him a Dorothy Hamill haircut, Dor aren't you? Dor exactly. Little Dorothy Hamill, I, I was going to say. I knew that's what you are going for. <laughs> well, look at his hair. And the mother's kind of rocking it, too. she got the Lord Farquaad, mm. if you remember from Shrek. All he said was that Santa was more like a feeling. You know, more like a state of mind than a person. And who gave you permission to tell Charlie there's no Santa Claus? Why do guys always have to fight? For real. Yeah. He pulls his pants up mm -hmm. so that they know he means business. Neil and your mom, they don't believe in Santa because they were real naughty. It's kind of babyish to believe in that kind of stuff. Okay. Little 30 year old. Right. I believe in Santa Claus. I'm not a baby. <laughs> it does seem kind of backwards, though. You feel like it'd be like Tim Allen's character trying to tell him that don't worry about Santa Claus. It's not real. And then the mom's trying to make him believe. So, built in. Oh, I love that song. Oh, so good. What are the those things turkey? at the end of the legs? I don't know what they're called, but there's a name for them. Oh, he tried. Look, he tried to make it. Really? You make all that money and you wouldn't have it catered for you and your son? He's trying to be a good dad, I think, you know? Like, doing it himself. But yeah. Then... It's Denny's. Denny's. Everybody likes Denny's. It's an American institution. Yeah. Dad wants the turkey. It's not that good. Oh, yeah. That's why. Come on. Lots of dads with their sons. Oh, that's right. Yeah. So all the men are divorced with one child. One of them has two. 
<laughs> He's injured. He's got the bandage on his hand. Delicious seasonal favorite. Eggnog. We're out. All chocolate milk, please. We're out. Plain milk's fine. <laughs> oh, my God. Denny's is horrible. I know, right? Did they not plan? You know, the biggest night for dads. Oh, not on the lawn. There arose such a clatter. I sprang from my bed to see what was the matter. What's that? A rose is a word that means it came, and clatter is a big noise. But you do believe in Santa, right, Dad? Of course I believe in Santa. Do you believe in Santa? Mm, sure. You better. What? I heard clatter. Where are your pants? No, for real. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's Clark Griswold. Oh, he broke his tailbone. Or just dead. Oh, he landed on snow. It's he like landing dead. on a cloud. Don't figure out who you are, I'll, I'll give you a lift back to the mall. Santa Claus. Put on my suit. The reindeer will know what to do. Oh, he waves, poor thing. Oh, my God. Like, die. He's still friendly at the end. Ooh. It's a Chevy sleigh. That's hardcore right there. Oh. oh. Dehydrated. Reindeer on the road. Where the hell did this come from? Magic. Ho, ho, Home Depot. <laughs> the Rose, such a clatter company. Oh, isn't that clever? Dad, check out Santa's sleigh. Listen, Charlie, I'm not kidding. Let's go. Oh, oh. Yeah. Come on, Charlie. He didn't even put the suit on. Effects back then. Well, he's going to put it on in the car. Oh. Or the sleigh. If we go straight on this road and we hit I-94. When the edibles hit. That's true, right? <laughs> oh, that's a fancy house. Oh, right that there. is a nice house. This whole thing is stupid. How come everything I want to do is stupid? Oh, not now. Mm -hmm. How do I look? Nice? <laughs> How am I supposed to know what to leave? Maybe there's a list. Check it twice. A list. It's okay, I'm used to it. I lived through the 60s. <laughs> Those special effects. Oh. Oh. Hmm? See, that's how you know it's a fancy Christmas tree. It's just very monochromatic. There's no family ornaments. It's all just Neiman Marcus. Uh oh. Oh my gosh. Oh. What did it feel like, Dad? It felt like America's most wanted. <laughs> Hilarious, Tim Allen. Hold it. There's no chimney here. Come on. Look at the size of this thing. See? It's sucked in like a black hole. What? Okay, that's some fancy magic right there. There goes like 3% of the budget. <laughs> so you remodeled their house. For real. And it's like now it's a cooking fireplace. Now that's a family tree. Santa? Scott Calvin. <laughs> Oh. It's like the Grinch. You're supposed to drink the milk. I'm lactose intolerant. I'm lactose oh, he is. Intolerant. <laughs> supposed to drink that milk. It's back to normal. Oh, they shouldn't put the stockings on the re on that heater. It's gonna catch fire. Yeah, that's true. I'll just set it right here. Yep. Before it slips and falls over the tree. That's a nice gift, though. I'm sorry, nice. like. Oh, it falls. Oh, oh, you're right. You're right. Like talking to yourself, <laughs> your two personalities discussing with each other and giving each other compliments. That's smart. Is that the North Pole? Does this look like home to you guys? Yeah. Uh -huh. Hey, hey. Okay, bye. Yeah, they're doing their own thing, aren't they? Ooh. What's the North Pole? The actual pole? What are you doing? Oh, that's going to be one, two, three, four, five. I'm like, no matter North Pole or Grandma's house, it's always the same code. There he goes, okay, going down. Okay, yeah. that's nice. We should get that for our house. Yes, we'll get a kid that <laughs> taps on a barber pole and suddenly our car sinks into the ground. Oh, okay. Oh, this kid never gets any work done. Okay, Santa must be violating several labor laws oh, on child, child labor. Child, child, I think if you put ears on him and call him elves, you can get around the child labor laws. That's how it works. Okay. Who's in charge here? I'm not a kid. I have plenty of shoes that are older than you. Oh, mm. put you in your place. Who are you? I'm Bernard. Hi, Bernard. Bernard? Hey, you sport. 
I got something for you. Okay, what you got? Bro. Now hold out your hand, all right? Kiss, kiss, see? Kmart. I promise I'll take real good care of it. Aw. It's going to be broken in five minutes. I Probably. 10 bucks broken in five minutes. Can we take a direct flight back to reality? Look, Barnaby, I just want to go home. Barnaby. Oh, my God. These are the toys that, like, parents just dread their kids getting. In putting on the hat and jacket, you accepted the contract. What contract? You got the card. Oh. And putting on the suit and entering the sleigh, the wearer waves any and all rights to any previous identity by either accident or design. The Santa Claus. You leave tomorrow morning. You have 11 months to get your affairs in order and you're due back here Thanksgiving. What if I don't buy into this Santa Claus thing? Uh-oh. Now there's a skunk at the garden party. <laughs> oh. oh, don't fall for that. He's 45, just like the other kid said. Low gingerbread. Judy will take you to your room. Get out of the suit. It needs to be cleaned. And taken in. Oh, they do the close-ups, right? Here are your pajamas. I'll be right back. Scott Ooh. Calvin. Santa Claus. See, he's got the initials. Scott oh. Calvin. Santa Claus. <gasps> I brought you some cocoa. My own recipe. Took me 1,200 years to get it right. Oh, how old is the milk? You should see the cow. <laughs> I'm mean, gonna have to admit that bed is actually making me sleepy. It looks so yeah. comfy. All those pillows and like the fluffy duvet and everything. It's like a sleigh bed. Ah, a sleigh oh, bed. Oh, 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 oh. oh, he's still wearing the PJs. Let's see. Yeah, Santa Claus. Ah, oh, Santa. Dad took me to the North Pole and Larry showed me the workshop. What's this all about? Dad's the new Santa. Oh, okay. Papa's, Papa's got a brand new bag. Perhaps this is a good time to bring up the psychiatrist. How does dad go first? My dad is Santa Claus. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Oh boy. Kids say the darnest things. Yep, right. <laughs> this is far more serious than a boy believing or not believing in Santa Claus. You need to sit down with Charlie, explain to him, you are not Santa Claus. I know who you are, dad. You'll figure it out soon enough. Oh, here come the reindeer, oh, the reindeer. yeah. How many reindeers were there? Eight tiny reindeer. Oh, I thought it was nine. With Rudolph, I think it is, right? Uh, yeah, because it was like Rudolph was the knight. That's true. How can one man in one night visit all the children of the world? Not everyone celebrates Christmas. I think there's some sort of time continuum. The kid's no chump. He's got a few oh, ideas. He's really smart. I mean, you're not listening. We are very concerned about this. Concerned about what? If the Charlie's spending time with you is the best thing for him. Oh, here we go. What? That is an ugly sweater. Well, it looks like those mats you take naps on when you're in kindergarten, remember? But you see the angle he's going now, right? Trying to get, take custody away from mm. him. Now they're like, we don't know if it's such a good idea for you to be spending time, which they're trying to use this against him now. Charlie, there, there is no reason why we have to tell anybody about the North Pole. Let's keep it secret. How come? Out of five bucks, honey. There you go. Kids know the language of currency, right? They know money. <laughs> Not a few pounds. Saturated fats. What? Something's wrong with the scale. Ah! The dry cleaner in my neighborhood <clears throat> went up in smoke. They're like, <gasps> hit the gasp, right? So, did I miss anything? Just about to order lunch. I'll have a Caesar, no dressing, and a little slice of cheesecake, mm. a creme brulee, and a hot fudge sundae. Extra hot fudge. That's a lot of sugar. And a Diet Coke. On the side. <laughs> Okay, now we've got Santa. He's up in the North Pole. He's getting ready <laughs> for Christmas. Oh, what's that? A tank? Total oh. tank. Hell Wait yeah. Wait a minute. Ooh. No way. But what about the reindeer? Reindeer and Santa? Santa and a reindeer? It, it, it's kind of a package deal. Can I see you outside a minute? Oh, you're going to get fired. See a doctor, a shrink, a dietitian, anything. Just get some help. I'd be concerned. Even if I was supposed to be Santa Claus, I'd be like, uh, I need to figure out a different way because... Mm -hmm. well, your pulse is great. Uh, well, I don't know, Scott. You're, you're as healthy as a horse. Yeah. Clydesdale. <laughs> what? You put on a little weight. A little weight? Does this look like a little weight to you? Mm. The sound effect. I've gained 45 pounds in a week. Oh, oh my, my gosh. gosh. Ooh, that's like when you live next to the Golden Corral. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
That's a clever little that touch, is. huh? I think it's safe to say you're taking the Santa thing to an unhealthy level. This is beginning to scare me. I never in my wildest... Well, no, okay, Laura's belt, wildest. look at her. It's the braided one. I used to oh, have that yeah. belt in the 90s. Did you loop it around? Yeah. Did you loop it on the inside? <laughs> like, with your with your Jabot jeans? To make a knot oh, going yeah. down. I got a delivery Ooh. for SC. USC? Scott Calvin, that's me. Yeah, sign here, please. Uh, and they just nice Amazon shop. just drop it in the front porch and take a picture. Oh, it didn't work like that in like those days. I'll leave the door open, just leave him inside here. Look, it's all my hopes and dreams being sent <laughs> back to me. <laughs> it's the list. Oh, that's the list. That's all the names. Oh my god. Oh, oh starting holy with the crap. A. Oh Jesus, no. Mm -mm. Johnny naughty. <laughs> Very nice. Veronica, very nice. In your dreams, Playboy. Ooh. No. Oh my god, it looks like the cafeteria lady at my old school when I was in elementary school. She also shaved? Yeah. Well, no, not really. <laughs> so it's not an exact match, but I'm in big trouble. Charlie, do you mind if I talk to you for a minute? Oh, it's a judge. Oh, they're at court. Oh, it's a judge. Oh, you sneaky, sneaky biatch. What was the toy you wanted the most? Do you remember when you were a kid? Anything that stands out? I wanted, I think it was an easel that was like a chalkboard with chalk. Oh, yeah. I remember going with my mom to Walmart and she was buying it and I was like, oh, she's <gasps> buying it for me. And she told me like, oh no, it's not for you, babe. It's for like another little boy. Oh, you were like crushed. Yes. I'm like, why would she buy them my favorite toy that I've been telling her? It was for it's me. for you. Yeah. And then she did the, the meme with the mug. Like <laughs> when she gets you the thing you think you're getting. Aww. I told him oh, he probably used the secret word. Oh, you can't say secret. I've come to a very difficult decision. I'm granting the petition of Dr. and Mrs. Miller. <gasps> oh, he's crying. All of your visitation rights are suspended. Now he becomes Santa Doubtfire. <laughs> Starts working at the house. We're his goddamn kids, too. <laughs> Man, if it wasn't Tim Allen, they should use um, Robin Williams would have played a awesome Santa Claus. Yeah, but literally in 94, he was playing Mrs. Doubtfire. Oh, that's These true. two movies came out the same time. Probably around the same. Well, he could have played both of them. He could have, yeah, but still. Hey, Neil. You're not supposed to be here. Charlie, listen. You listen. Oh. He's not Santa. He You're going to get me in trouble, kid. Could you guys leave us alone for a minute? You're not his father. Oh, my God. He, like, huffs away like a girl. You know what I mean? Like, not like girls. You know, you know. I'm not digging your toxic machismo, David. I know. You know me. I'm such a, I'm such a machismo kind of guy. <laughs> my girlfriends know what I mean. <laughs> Boy, this bird is dry. Haven't you people heard about basting? What? Can I go? Please, can I go, Bernard? It's okay with me. This... Is our perpetrator. Oh my Scott god. Calvin. Oh yeah, there's no way they're gonna take this seriously. Uh, won't the uh, bright red suit and beard give him away? <laughs> it's like police academy. Right, oh my god, <laughs> yes. Honey, how are you? Are, are you? Where are you? Are you okay? We're in the North Pole. I'm fine. Mm. We're at the North oh, Pole. Of course. I knew it. Mm. The We're the Christmas stuff. squad. Oh yeah. All right, let's go. Uh -huh. You ready to go, Whole family's coming? No, they're just there to see them off, I oh. think. What's this? Oh, that's a CD. Cookie Cocoa Dispenser. Out pops the cookie. He like really upgraded the sleigh from when he got it, right? Is that the same girl? You're fabulous. Oh. <laughs> I think the milk's a little sour. It's soy milk. You said oh. you're lactose intolerant. Oh, oh, so sweet. Freeze. Oh, the toy radio's in the hat, so he doesn't have his hat on. Mm -mm. We've got a problem. Santa is at the Miller's, but he's not responding. Let's go! Oh, Release the secret weapon! <laughs> oh, he's just showing off now. That was not necessary. Oh, I want one of those. What? Those rocket launchers. Oh, yeah. We're here to bust out my dad. You're the Calvin boy. We're your worst nightmare. Oh God! With hmm. attitude. Oh my oh. God! If like this kid practiced that line at home, so cheesy. like all day before he had to go in there and shoot. But you know, when you're a kid, these are those scenes that are like, you live for these scenes, right? 
Like you fast forward the whole movie just to this part. I don't know. I didn't have a childhood. Now here we go. What? Ooh, took off the hinges. They did. Oh, the whole door. That's taxpayer dollars right okay. there, though. I think it's a much better idea. You stay with your mom. That you stay here with your mom and me. I can't be with you all the time. We're a Aww. family. Look how much he's progressed as a dad too though. You know what I mean? You believed in me when nobody else did. You helped make me see it. Oh my God. It's you. Yes. I have been trying to tell you yes, lady. Yes, exactly. It's Santa. Oh, she believes again. I want you to come and see Charlie as often. <gasps> oh, you can count on it. What's all this boo-hooing going on here? I'm just saying goodbye to Charlie. Charlie, you still got the glass ball, right? Yeah. Shake it whenever you want to see your dad. Oh, he can see his dad that way. Uh-oh. Tip, look up there. Yeah. Oh. He's getting away. Don't worry, we've got the Air Force with the <laughs> F-15s. Oh, Ooh. look at that. She's a little Keebler. Yeah. And so is he. Merry Christmas to all. And to all, a good night. Good night. Oh, look at that. It's like Hunger Games. The sponsors. Uh, Oscar, Oscar Mayer Wiener. Wiener, he said he wanted earlier. Aw. Hey, sport. Do you want to go for a quick ride? Of course, it's up to your mom. Okay. Go on, get out of here. Get out of here. It's the man in the moon. Oh, Santa goes across the moon. There you go. Better than you thought, or it was better than I expected. Okay, yeah. So not your favorite, of course. No, they're not my favorite, really, but yeah. I can see why a lot of kids and families would be entertained. Oh, by this. totally. I was definitely entertaining. Totally. And this is one of those kind of movies families can have on in the background, yeah, right? For you know, sure. During the holiday season, right? Disney Plus is a typical Disney yeah. Plus show. There's other Christmas movies that I really enjoy, but this was different. I, I'd never seen it. Yeah, um, I do like Tim Allen. You know, oh, Tim Allen's great. Yeah, I do like Tim Allen, but I like them in that sitcom we like to watch. Last Man Standing. Last Man Standing. Yeah. I do like Tim Allen in Last Man Standing. So probably not then Santa Claus Two is what you're saying. Please no. <laughs> we have some other movies come that you probably will like. I won't tell you what they are because some of them I know are surprises. Okay. Uh, some you already know, like Home Alone Two. <gasps> love Home yeah. Alone. Yeah. I love that one. So yeah, I'll definitely yeah, enjoy that. That'll be a good one. Yeah. But thank you guys so much for watching. Always. Really appreciate it. Let us know as usual. Yes. Anything we missed as far as notes, uh, trivia about the mm. movie. You know, we'd find that stuff so interesting, and you guys are great about that. We certainly yes. certainly appreciate thank it. You so also, much. Uh, be sure to subscribe to the channel if you like these kind of videos. Yes. A like is always appreciated. Those are things that are completely free to you. Yeah. And they really do help the channel. Uh, anything else you want to add before we go? No, that's it. You guys have a great rest of the day slash night, and we will see you in the next video. Bye. I love the chase and the hunt, and I set the pace when I'm running. I always take what I want, and I always give it 100. Don't need a bank, no, I'm funded. Play the game like it's nothing. I'm always thankful for something. Don't take for granted. Stay humble.